country, NAGRAT, NAT, TEU, and CCT, have launched a campaign hashtag drop the pre tertiary education bill now. According to them, the bill in its current form will not serve the interests of the teacher and by extension education in this country. They want the bill dropped or they want the bill to be revised to reflect their concerns. This morning on Daily Runs, we are speaking with some regional executives from the Western and Western North regions for them to tell us or share with us the specific provisions in the bill that they believe is inimical to them. This is the Daily Runs. Let's keep talking. We are in the teaching profession. We should have unified conditions of service. We should have unified code of ethics. And looking at the bill, one district is going to have its own conditions of service. Another district is going to have its own conditions of service. Fragmented. Fragmented. If you look at doctors, they have a whole unified code of conduct. If you look at lawyers, you have unified code of uh, conduct. So why are you fragmenting the teacher's fund? Ghana higher education is it? Why you be a teacher for? What what the education is not want to win one in fifty. In the at the bill like this, a parliament, pre teacher education bill. In to inform parliament, we have any way. In the first place, this bill went to parliament without a consent. And when the more young, the ones who put away a policy, born who are from Hong Kong, who feel the jama, who are who are in the middle of the technocrats who they call. And now, at the church, for now, here you have implementers and we didn't have to Example, typical example, Nancy, the worker year 28, and the way them uh, the new character will probably such as JHS. No, why are you not offering consultation? How many hours? Three hours, four hours. Where do you call this consultation that is going to do for a whole curriculum that is going to be for JHS one to SHS one? Do you call it consultation? Actually, in Kano, in our management of schools and uh, district assemblies and what have you, you feel the mistake in MCC, you know, we are centralized, you know, we under one ministry. Ah, when you're at the various branch, the GES, which is also managing it at the various district level. And this is the same thing. You're saying you're going to have to do district directorate in NASA and other assemblies in NASA. In fact, you are not helping us. For a teacher to be dismissed, you know, and send away a teacher, you know, it is determined by GES council. Then the, the DCE can sit in his or her office and then dismiss a teacher. A teacher he thinks he opposes to his, maybe the uh, policies of his party. He can just go, even verbally, can dismiss you. We know what is happening in our politics. Please, our president, Teacher for Teacher for woman face If you look at the bell, us in there, there shall be an education officer appointed by the uh, uh, DC. So who is going to be that education officer? It's not categorically stated there. Uh, somebody who has risen through the ranks. In the teacher now, you are uh, uh, confined to the classroom and nothing else. And they have even started. Look at the hierarchy of Ghana Education Service. One can say director general. She need deputy. Go to director uh, uh, in charge of uh, HRMD. Go to director in charge of uh, IPPD. And anything that they do in education. Look at the curriculum workshop. Disaster. Uh, SHS uh, workshop that they did in the various universities. Disaster. If they have been in the system, they will have known that this is what I have to put in place before I do this. So, if you have been in the system, you will have to put in place education management for teachers. Yes. And I want to share that when you teach any other. Yes. That is what they are saying that as a teacher, you have no business being in management. Wow. That is what they are saying. Uh -huh. But yes, yeah, my main Ghana police here yeah, uh, 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 example. If you're Ghana police, uh, one way IGP is you not know, a policeman from uh, 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 scratch. So why the old teacher, Uncle Tien, no, 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 they want to uh, bring somebody from outside. They're on no only some teacher for now. Yeah, somebody has worked for 25, 30 uh, years in the service. Can you compare that person to somebody who is coming from another uh, 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 sector? Yes, yes, section 23 of the bill. The president shall, in accordance with Article 195 of the Constitution, appoint officers necessary for the efficient and effective performance of functions of the Ghana Education Service. Even sometimes when they say that the president shall do this in consultation with some group, what, what are the consultations being done? Now go to section uh, the, the same 23 2. The president may appoint other public officers who may be transferred or seconded to the education service or may otherwise give assistance to the education service. So surreptitiously, they want to bring in this idea of bringing private people to manage our schools. How can we say the president would appoint any, somebody? And if you go to the three, on the program, you know, the GES may engage the service of a consultant as determined by the council. Consultant or 
Nancy is them say we what's up for the consultant wobwa. I say I said when the GS want a consultant, they do. You, you see, you don't need any new thing. You don't need any new thing there. I'm telling you that for a fact that the problems of GS, every president, every politician, they know the problem of GS. They know it. They should solve the problems. My observation is about the section 31 of the bill, where the head of local government service will be appointing heads and staff of district education unit, as well as be responsible for promotion, transfer, discipline, and dismissal of staff of district education unit, where district uh, uh, that is education officers at the various district will be doing appointment. Our fear here is that sometimes serial callers may be appointed How to become heads because if they are going to appoint, they are going to appoint their faithfuls and then those who are in the same soup with them. Where somebody who doesn't have any the qualification to become a head will become a head of a school and things will even go from worse to bad or from bad to worse. Do yes, no. Your condition of service, sir. What you're saying now? You're in Obi or Chadu Keji. Obi or Chadu Secondary School. We all have a codified, unified condition of service. In the Chadu and Himpa, that's not it. Now, since the assemblies are going to be in charge of the of the schools, are they going to be in charge of the payment of salaries as well? The bill is silent. The bill is silent. Since I am that these assemblies in this country, they are not the same. The resources are different. In Tibutma Bede, yeah, what this is the EBA assembly be are on the one scan was in Tibutma show one teacher for ye better than another assembly. Not teacher in Miss Oroka or put up a transfer in part. What's a jiro called head of local service national and some work at your transfer from one district to another. In to say your parent decentralization, not a decentralization, you're bearing you into your district. No more than you panel called national and some work. What is the essence of this bill itself? You're fond of you, has he see an assembly work called transfer to that would be. About if you are about transfer her wife or child or cry, you want your wife to join you. It means your wife should resign from Accra Metro, then come and seek appointment in Takradi Metro. Well, if you resign, eh, then if you come to Takradi Metro, no what's in the vacancy in you are, what do you do? Or chade abaye intien teacher fumi safan onu ne demadi o o o o o o o o this is assembly. Uh, the chief administrator there is uh, district coordinating director. No rank here, director, assistant director one. Assistant director one. Eba me district director or metro director. No rank here, director two. Director two. Eh? So that coordinating director who is assistant director one, who is going to manage my director who is what? Director two. I mean, what, 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 what is this? We are in public service. We are not civil servants. Yes. And this one cannot change it. Yes. We are public servants under Article 195 of the Constitution. It says that there shall be public service. And it listed them, Ghana Police Service, Ghana Education Service, Ghana Health Service. So you are not doing that to Ghana Health Service. You are not doing that to Ghana Police Service. Why Education Service? Go to Section 36. Teachers employed in the basic schools are on coming into force of this act, transferred to local government service. If it is, yes, I said yes. What do you mean? Are we civil servants or public servants? Meanwhile, there's a Supreme Court ruling in the in the matter that uh, they took the Ghana Education Service. Some uh, lady who works at the Swedru Senior High School mm -hmm. and then the Ghana Highway Authority, marking, uh, I find you marking to them to court. And the Supreme Court ruled that the Ghana Highway Authority and the Ghana Education Service have been specif specifically been lifted from the civil servants. So now, if this bill now takes us back, are we going against the Supreme Court ruling? Why is it over the teacher? Teacher for Bonabaya, Abada, and the Ayah Mensa Bibia, Adibia, teacher, Adibia, teacher. What is government seeking to do to the teachers? Teacher for Yesro, Yaya Bonabia. Yesro, P. Damayan, press statement, you know. Yes, we are humbly appealing that with immediate effect, the bill should be suspended and then broader consultation should be made. We have a suspicion, we have a serious suspicion. It, it look as if they are finding the unions too uh, 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 powerful, so they want to break our front. If not, I don't see the essence of this bill. Then some time ago, we also uh, uh, spoke against the privatization of our basic schools. And if you look at the bill, uh, they, they have a full paragraph or a full page for private schools. 
What, 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 what does that mean? Section 32 of the bill. The district officer. This is the director of the district officer. This is the director of education. No. I want to hear cool. The district officer in charge of education unit at the Department of Education and Sports on behalf of the head of local government and acting on the recommendation of the head of the this education unit is responsible for the appointment, promotion, discipline, dismissal of the head teachers and staff of the basic schools. So you can dismissal of the teachers are. It is the function of the GS council to dismiss a professional teacher. It's the function of the GS council. So you don't bring that, that particular function. The district officer that he's talking about, it can be a serial caller. Yes, it's it. It can be a serial caller. Somebody, somebody that's appointed by the president, by the DC. And when the main pain or all the non who are dismissed teachers. In the GS councillor, the person will be given fair hearing. You go to the disciplinary committee. If you are not satisfied, you can go to a regional level. If you are not satisfied, you can go to a national level so that you can seek redress of the issue. As it stands now, you are dismissed at the district level. And there's no provision unless maybe the Supreme Court or the court uh, 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 what comes to your aid. This is what the provision that we have. My question is, are these things necessary? You know what GS are? The Madi, you know what GS are. Problems are how they solve. And yet, Billy, no what GS. One man, you know what Ghana, no, 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 no